Well, uh, Bo uh, in the room gave you high marks on, on music and uh, and feels that you're uh, on the way to making you know high marks in basketball. Yeah. I guess personally, what are your goals for this year, and how eager are you eager are you to kind of make that next step? Oh yeah, I'm definitely excited, uh, especially getting a taste in the Final Four last year and uh, getting a little bit of playing time here and there. Uh, I think I'm definitely ready to. Um, help out with a bigger role this year offensively and defensively. There have been some pretty big battles, uh, I'm told, in practice uh, oh, yeah. you and, and your uh, new roommate. Uh, what, what has that been like and, uh, and what are you guys, what's going through your head as you're out there battling knowing that you know there might be opportunities uh, you know, to be a, a key front court contributor? Yeah, it's just good competition. Um, you know, I know if I push him and get him stronger, he'll only help the team out even more. So uh, battling like that with, uh, with your friends is good so that you're ready for your opponents on the floor. What uh, what have you done in the off season? What, what's, what, what's been your regimen in terms of getting ready for this year uh, uh, to, to try to take the next step? Yeah, I've just been working on my uh, explosion lateral quickness and uh, so that I can guard uh, more than just in the post and uh, get back to blocking shots like I used to in high school. <laughs> <laughs> Has that been a tough transition to you know feel out what you can and can't do compared to what you were able to do in high school? Um, I think it's just figuring out how to do what I was able to do. So I don't think that I there's nothing that I can't do anymore, you know, I just need to figure out what to do, so I'm starting to figure that out now. Do you, uh, how much do you draw from what Frank does in the, in the climb that he made, and uh, has he been a good role model in terms of, he seems to be a guy that, you know, is a reflection of what hard work can do for someone. Oh yeah, yeah, Frank, he doesn't talk that much, but uh, <laughs> he definitely leads by example, um, and so yeah, I, I got to practice and study him, you know, just as much as I do the other teams, because he's got those moves in the post, and I want to add some of that to my game as well. The uh, the way that this uh, team uh, ended last year was it? Uh, how long did it take to kind of look back on that whole thing? Is it positive? Mm -hmm. You know, I know that that last game hurt, but uh, and and when did you start looking forward to this season? Uh, it didn't take too long. Like obviously, you know, we wish we could have gone the extra step, but having made it there it was you could still look back and be proud on that. And I think within a week or two, we were we were ready for the next year, hungrier than ever to get back. And I'm sure fans are wondering, will we hear from Vito again this year before games? Uh, anything else in the musical repertoire? Uh, yeah, we actually, uh, my family is singing the national anthem against Boise State on okay. November 22nd. So there you go. It should be fun, yeah. Well, looking forward to it. Vito, Thank you. good luck this year. Appreciate it.